Hello, this is a video submission uh, for the paper entitled High Speed Robot Navigation Using Predicted Occupancy Maps. Uh, the basic goal of this paper is to develop generative neural networks that allow us to predict occupancy maps that extend beyond the line of sight of the, of the sensor. Uh, further, we develop control algorithms that can leverage this predicted occupancy map for, with the goal of producing higher motions. And finally, we perform preliminary real world hardware experiments um, that use the MIT race car, uh, where we show that uh, the advantages of using map prediction uh, using the onboard sensors and the onboard platform for compute. Our basic architecture leverages the sensors on the platform, uh, including the Intel real sense for both RGB in depth and odometry. Uh, we use RTAB map to produce a 2D occupancy map that is uh, limited by the, the sensor's field of view. Further, we use an occupancy map uh, neural prediction neural network uh, that we developed to be able to predict regions of the occupancy map that extend beyond the line of sight of the sensor. Further, we develop a control algorithm that uses the predicted occupancy map along with the goal and the robot odometry uh, to ultimately produce control commands uh, onto the robot platform uh, to execute at higher speeds than uh, without the predicted occupancy map. Here are a set of videos that just demonstrate the advantages of using occupancy map. This is at a lower speed at uh, two meters per second um, without map prediction, uh, just to demonstrate that the, we are able to reach the goal, uh, albeit at, at a lower speed, uh, but the trajectory was much jerkier. Uh, we then ran at a higher speed of three meters per second, uh, and in this case, uh, also without prediction, uh, and in this case, the robot um, is not able to make it to the goal and, and instead collides with the, with the wall. Our final video demonstrates the robot traveling at a higher speed of three meters per second with map prediction. As you can see on the right, the gray regions represent the predicted occupancy map that extends beyond the line of sight of the sensor. Uh, using map prediction, we're able to uh, navigate to the goal with much smoother trajectories, uh, as well as operating at higher speeds of three meters per second in this video. Our subsequent testing demonstrated similar results at four meters per second. Thank you.